Celebrating God's holy days is such a special thing, not because you're forced to or any form of legalism or anything of the sort, but simply by looking at God's seven appointed times, these biblical feasts that were set apart from all the other days, and the point that God gave them for the purpose of pointing to Christ. We see with the spring feast how they were fulfilled in Christ's first coming. And then we can look at the fall feast and see how they will be fulfilled at his second coming. Now, I don't know about you, but I look forward each and every day to the return of Christ. I cannot wait for the day that I am reunited with the King, that I'm no longer living in the sinful, fallen, and evil world, but I will be in the very presence of the Lord and never have to leave that. What's not to look forward to? And that's what makes the fall holy days so amazing to celebrate. With Yom Teruah, the Feast of Trumpets, Yom Kippur, the Day of Atonement, and then Sukkot, the Feast of Booths or Tabernacles. These days are so amazing because just as the apostles are constantly pointing to the return of Christ throughout the epistles, that's what these holy days do. Over and over again in scripture, we see in these references and celebrations, these understandings of these fall feasts, it points to this time when Messiah returns. He's with his people. He is truly glorified. We can look to the millennial reign of Christ and see in scripture where the world will come together and literally descend upon Jerusalem to celebrate the Feast of Booths. God cares about these days so much that he even says there will be a punishment for any nation who doesn't show up because these days are so special. They mean so much. And the more we dig into them and we learn about them, why not have special days set apart to come together as a family and look with excited anticipation to that return of Christ? Because we know that his return is near. Jesus is returning. He's calling his people to him. Tribulation will fall upon the world and unrepentant Israel. Christ will literally put his feet on the Mount of Olives. He will stand and reign in Jerusalem for 1,000 years before eternity. There's so much to learn about. There's so much to be excited about. There's so much to share with our children, our family, our friends. Jesus is coming. And be it by death or rapture, I want to be ready today and every day to be reunited with the King. So our family cannot wait to celebrate these fall feasts this year and every year as a sort of dress rehearsal of just excited anticipation and joyous celebration as we look forward to this amazing reunion that every day we're one day closer to seeing. God's holy days are beautiful. They're wonderful. They're truly meaningful because they all point to and will find their fulfillment in Christ alone. Jesus, the Messiah, God's one and only Son. Hey friends, I am so excited to celebrate these biblical holy days starting here at the end of the month. And I want to share this information with you all. This has been a study that we've done before. I've shared different vlogs and videos. You can find them all on our fall playlist here at the end of the video. But I would love to invite you guys to come over. We have compiled these lessons, sermons, printables, study materials. We've compiled all of this into a 
private class that you guys can purchase to study through with your family as you prepare to dig in and celebrate these special appointed times. Now, with this class, you get lifetime access to these videos, sermons, printables, all of the goodies, and you also get any lifetime updates that we may add to this as the years go by, Lord willing. So we have everything linked down in the description below, and we pray that this truly can be a blessing to your family. We know that we have families around the globe this year joining in on this study and celebrating with their families as we look forward to Christ's return. So thank you guys for hanging out with us today. Be sure to get that down below in the description. Subscribe and like this video, and we will see you all in the next vlogs. Bye guys.